Here's a secret weapon for lower back pain. Whether you're suffering from chronic symptoms or acute spasms, this is a great way to relieve the pain and restore health to the area. Finding the thoracic lumbar trigger point can be a little tricky, but stick with it. It's sure to become one of your favorites. What we're gonna do is feel for a nook between your spine and your ribs, about an inch and a half out from the vertebrae. So what I'll do here is I'll place my hand on the door sill and I'll push with my left foot and take weight off of my right foot. As I'm doing this, a lot of times I'll feel a little bit of um, almost numbness going down my right leg as I'm doing the right side. That's a really nice feeling. This is kind of a hurt so good. I'm not massaging or going up and down. I'm just putting pressure into that trigger point. This is great for releasing the QLs and the erector spinae, those large muscles in the back that control the stability and often are involved in a spasm. So as I'm pushing like this, I might do this for 30 seconds or so. If uh, I'm really experiencing a problem in the area, I will continue on the area for maybe two minutes, practicing some deep nasal breathing, and then I will just simply go to the other side and do exactly the same thing, where I will be pushing with my right foot this time and taking weight off my left foot so that it has no weight, no bearing weight on it at all. Again, I'm feeling a little bit of a sensation running down my left leg, and this is having a conversation to calm the nervous system, block pain signals from the brain, and ultimately release that spasm from my lower back so I can get on to living again.